What's up guys, I will be showing you how to get the best micro video settings as possible and to get as much FPS as possible. So the first thing is to open the micro launcher because I will show you how to allocate more RAM to get more FPS and then I will just show you the best micro video settings. So open the micro launcher and wait a couple of seconds. It will load up and we need to get to the settings so installation step please and well, as you can see 1.19.3 click here the three dots edit and more options gvm arguments and i already have changed it to 8g but here's the thing guys so if you have 16 gigabytes of ram use 8g uh, i have 16 gigabytes of ram if you have 8 gigabytes of ram please use 4g and if you have 4 GB of RAM, use 2G. And if you have 2 GB of RAM, in case you have that on your low end PC, use 1G. So I will be using the ADG for thing. So please hit save and hit play. This will give you more FPS because you have to allocate it just for your computer. If you have too many GB of RAM, allocate it it will not work completely fine and you can have some luck spikes and luck stutters so i'm in the minecraft 119.3 go to the single player and my name is or not my name or my word's name is the sherlock so i will be showing you how to do it on my word that i have made so we are here go to the options please you first thing escape options and we don't have to change anything in here so skin customizations this is up to you it will not just boost your fps so you can just leave everything on music and sound nothing video settings so full screen i don't have full screen so i'm not using that so you can just leave current biome blend so please get this to off and that's the fastest options graphics you can leave that on fancy if you have a little bit better computer but if you have a really low end pc just get it back to fast so the render distance and simulation distance so this is pretty amazing guys because just drag it all the way to six and four this is the best seconds I have found. Six and five, sorry. Because you can get a good render distance, as you can see, and it will not lag that much. So, get back. Six, four, six, five, yeah, we'll use it, please. Chunk Builder, use semi blocking. Yeah, this is the best option. Smooth lighting, we can turn it off because it just gives you more FPS. V Sync, you don't have to use that. I don't use it anymore to brightness. I like to have it on bright because if you are in the mines and you don't have torch, uh, it, it just, it's just, it's handy for you. And mid map levels, get it off and just go back here. You bobbing, you can have it. The, the, this, I will show you what this does. If you turn it off, when you are moving, it will not shake anymore. So yeah, it's just like this, it, it looks weird. So. I want to turn it on because the, nice you see how i shake nice so leave it on attack indicator we can turn it off cloud i like to have it for the fast because you just have clouds in it, when you turn it off it just looks really ugly particles minimal that's the best thing and auto save indicator you can leave it on on so you can see it's already uh, auto saving the world and that is everything guys if you want to get much more better fps you need to wait for optifine 1.19.3 as you can see i already have that video on my channel so you can check it out and i will be showing also the best optifine settings with that you can get even much more fps thank you for watching this video like and subscribe and have a nice day